Hi there. Today I'm going to tell you how to use product custom pro tab. Hi there. Today I'm tell you. Uh, today I'm going to tell you how to use this product custom tab log uh, tab plugin. So first of all, I'm here to you. I'm here to demonstrate you WordPress admin side so that you can know how to use this plugin. So first of all, we are going to check whether this plugin is installed or not just go to install plugin see there that you will get that WooCommerce custom tab so here it shows up my plugin there so it is already installed there. now I'm when you when you uh, when this plugin has been installed here so it will show you menu which menu this menu product tab here you can create all the uh, local tabs or global tabs so just click on product tab here it is showing you three tabs global tab tab one sorry tab two and tab one so global tab is used for for complete all products how much products you have it will show you automatically in there so no need to put is tab content one by one one by one all for all products so you can check there so how we can create a global tab first of all I am telling how to create this global tab click on add tab put name here global tab now go to this uh, go to downside here you can see that uh, it is showing two things Global tab and tab order. Tab order is used to show you that the order where uh, in which you want to see the product. Uh, this product tab should be visible on their uh, on product page. So if I select this yes and click on publish, so it will automatically publish this uh, this tab as a global tab. If you want to create a local tab, just put the name here and click on no. Okay. So after that, uh, when you uh, when you uh, publish this tab, so it will come local tab. This way, we, you can create global tab and product uh, local tab. Now I'm going to tell you how to use these tabs on product. So we are going here to product products. I have already created demo product, so I'm going to demonstrate this thing on this uh, demo product. So, this is your product data. Here you can see all local tabs, not global tab, it will show only local tab here. So, I have created two local tabs, tab 1 and tab 2 here. So, when I am clicking on tab 1, so here you can put that tab title that it will appear on that product side, product client side. If you want to disable this tab on this, uh, if you want to disable this tab. On this specific product just click here disable and it will automatically it will not show tab one on this product if you click on enable so it will show this here you can see the default text is coming here but you have put there if you want to change this text you can automatically change that or you can change uh, you can put anything else you want to know you want to put there so you can do this like this. okay now click on update or it will be shown as a published page. Now go to so here I am showing you tab one. This is my local tab, global tab, and this is my tab. Two. Why it is showing like this? Tab one, global tab, and tab two. You can do here. I am setting the tab order there. Add it. Add it. Add it. Here you can see tab one has tab order zero. Global tab has order one, and my last tab two has tab order two. So why this? Uh, you can order your tabs according to your set. So this way you can use our uh, my 
WooCommerce product custom tab pro plugin. If you have any queries, just write down to me ravi.raya at the gmail.com. I will happily to serve my services because you are <laughs> buying this plugin for, for my website. Thanks a lot.